Oh, we're really listing right now. Do you guys feel that? Oh, shoot. Are we? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Counter steer, counter steer. Oh, today we're going to be fishing for swordfish, and there's a huge storm on radar. Let's get started. All right, let's go ahead and no clip on here. Here's the fishing boat. Okay, we're going to be somehow fishing for swordfish on this thing. I don't even see any fishing rods, but that's completely fine. Here we go. Let's go ahead and get this thing started. Let's open this door here. Okay, this is a waterproof door they got going on here, so pretty cool stuff. Let's go ahead and get this thing started. So I think there's like a breaker panel somewhere. Where? Here it is. Okay. You got to turn on all these breakers and uh, we got a whole bunch of stuff. So lights, windlass, engine, bridge, and winches. So let's go ahead and turn on ignition and this thing should get started here. And I think we're already off and running. Okay. That was quite simple to set up. This thing is a little bit slow, but that's completely fine. We're just going to be fishing today. So we don't need to be going like 70 miles an hour. But yeah. We're going to head out over here. Hopefully we can fit under this bridge. That's the real question because these are some pretty tall sails. I don't even know what those are. Let me know in the comments what these um rope things are. I have no idea, but here we go um i don't know if we can make it under that bridge um we might have to go under that huge part right there where it's definitely made for us but i don't know about this um but yeah once we make it under this bridge i'm gonna go ahead and give you guys i'm gonna give you guys a bit of a tour there's not a whole lot of tour but i will give you a tour of what is here um we should probably figure out where reverse is at just in case we don't make it through but here we go can we make it through here let's go ahead and check it out on um, this is me really close oh my gosh that's like the perfect level if we do make it through um, I think we have enough room, maybe even a couple feet. Oh my gosh, that was so close. Okay, well, thankfully, we didn't have to take the long route and go into that bridge. But yeah, I'm going to go forward here. Are we full throttle? All right, how fast are we going? We're going like um, nine knots. Okay, that's about a little slower than our tsunami boat that we're building. But yeah, let's go ahead and go down here, take a little bit of a tour. We're going to turn on the lights and heating. Of course, we need heating. We got a really nice interior here. It's very luxury and just really cozy. We got a stove we can make ramen noodles on. Of course, we're going to do that. Um, some boxes up here for some reason, a microwave, and I don't know what all this stuff is. It, it looks like it's supposed to be here. You got like a doorbell or something here. That kind of looks like a doorbell. I don't know what that's supposed to be though. And then right here, we actually have a bathroom. Like I didn't know how they'd fit a bathroom in here, but it's a two by two bathroom. So really small. Um, the toilet is one single block. So it's a pretty small toilet. And then we have two beds right here for sleeping. So yes, we can sleep on them. And then we have three seats right here. So we could fit like, we could fit five people in here if we had two on the bed and three over there. But let's go outside the boat here, um, open the door. And then I think we actually have like an engine bay. So let's go ahead and check that out. Tires on the side of the boat going on there. Um, What's down here? Is this the engine bay I was talking about? Yes, it is. Okay. That's an interesting place for a hatch. I've actually never been down here, but we have some ventilation stuff and we got the engine here. So this is where all the serious stuff happens. This engine kind of sucks. It is like really not that powerful. It does really look cool. I like the yellow scheme they got going on here. And then we have some breaker panels and some instrument stuff. So yeah, let's go ahead and get up here and see if there's anything else we can look at. But yeah, there's like winches up here to uh, move those things up. And then really there's just like boxes and stuff. Um, but yeah, that's the boat. So let's figure out how we should not fall off the boat. Let's figure out how we should go fishing here do we have any ropes on board that i could like get a fishing knot to this is locked is that the hall yeah that is the hall okay so yeah like i said in the beginning we do have a huge storm on radar supposedly going towards us but we are fishing so i'm just trying to see how good this boat could actually survive waves because i did just buy it so hopefully it's pretty good because honestly my other boats really haven't been too good i'm gonna go ahead and put some ramen noodles on the stove real quick and all right let's grab some ramen noodles out of the pantry here all right put some on there Set it on for 10 minutes. I don't know how long you actually put them on for, but 10 minutes. Let's grab some of our seasonings here that we'll put on it when it's done cooking. There we go. And then we got our bowl. Perfect. Everything's looking good. We're on a little sailing trip right now. This is going great. All right. Ramen noodles are done. Okay. Let's go on this table here and start eating them. Now, these are some good ramen noodles. Oh my gosh. They're so good. Oh, what's going on out here? Hold on. We need to go back up to the bridge right now. I'll eat the ramen noodles later. Hold on. It's kind of picking up a little bit um okay this was expected but like this is already getting kind of crazy for this thing um we do have a stabilizer hold on let me show you guys this thing stabilizer it has like a this is what you call an active stabilizer so whatever part of the boat's like going up it goes to that side so it doesn't like tip over and capsize so yeah quite interesting stuff we got going on there but there's actually a nuclear power plant in front of us there so i don't know if we should go near that thing in a storm it might um, have a little episode there and explode so we're not going to stay tuned for that we're going to be hitting a left turn we're going to be going that way we did come from that island over there but yeah let's continue eating our ramen noodles here Ah, uh, the ac just kicked on what a nice ac this thing actually has an ac that's actually really cool and i actually think we have a lifeboat is that a lifeboat i don't know can that thing even float i don't think it can there's no seats in it so how would I even get in that thing? But we have these yellow flotation devices. I don't know if that's for the boat or for me to get on. 
this thing right here definitely is for me to float on if anything bad happens so yeah at least we got some safety measures in this thing well what the heck hold on our engine's on fire right now hold on we need to get outside this boat and figure out what's going on with our engine here please move door uh our engine's on fire hold on what's going on down here Oh, our engine's on fire. Okay, put out the fire. Put out the fire. Um, Did our engine overheat? Hold on. How hot is our engine? 111. That overheated. What the heck? How did this overheat? This is not even that fast. Well, um, the engine's burnt up and it's like still running at 7 RPS and it's decreasing. We got ourselves a bit of a situation here because look how fast we're going out here. We're really not going anywhere. I think this is actually just from the waves pushing us, so we're not doing too well. Um, Do we have any radios on board that I could communicate with like some type of other boat? I don't see anyone out here for a really long ways. Hopefully someone hears my radio signal, but I honestly don't see anyone. So it's not looking too good for us. Let's go ahead. Up back inside of this boat and yeah um we're gonna decrease the throttle we're just gonna shut down the engines we don't want to be blowing them up. engine overheated um engines blow up at 105 te celsius so i'm just looking for some radio equipment right now i don't see anything maybe they put it in the bathroom i don't know why they put it in here yeah i don't see anything interesting going on in here we do have a sink i didn't even realize that that's cool i really wish we had a shower but i don't think we have that um we have any radios in here this thing doesn't have a single radio in here how old is this boat oh my gosh i didn't even realize Look how rusted out this thing is. They told me this thing was brand new and it really doesn't look too brand new to me. I mean, that's just disgusting. Um, We're having issues here. The engine's not working. Hold on. Maybe since the temperature dropped, can we drive now? Let's see. Can we drive now? RPS. Oh, we can drive. It's only at six RPS though, so we're not really driving that fast. That's absolutely great. How much worse could this even get? I'm just so sick of this um okay well that just picked up really bad oh shoot why did i even say that i think i jinxed it on accident oh no oh i just saw lightning okay i could survive a storm but lightning is a little bit too much i cannot survive lightning oh oh my gosh these waves are crazy i almost just flew off the boat there okay maybe i should oh um i think all the water is electrified now that that thing just struck okay well i think that means it's time to get inside this boat is on some crazy waves right now i'm not trying to deal with that today get inside oh there's waves going over deck okay get inside get inside okay, in here it is nice and waterproof if i have the doors closed so let's make sure to close all the doors um our engine's on full sill and the engine's about to blow up again hold on shut it down shut it down we cannot have the engine explode i'm not trying to go out there again there's lightning going off all over the place holy okay i don't know what's going on out here oh we're really listing right now do you guys feel that oh shoot are we oh no oh no oh no counter steer counter steer oh shoot uh oh okay it's kind of flipping back over here please flip back over oh my gosh no flip back over he's doing some oh oh gosh it's going really fast propellers are going really fast oh the edges just blew up oh no i just heard that oh no oh no okay please flip back over at least that's the least you can do for me right now game here we go here we go here we go are we gonna flip back over oh my gosh i'm full right rudder or i'm full left rudder oh turn 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 oh no keep turning keep turning keep turning oh this is not looking too good here we go here we go did we level out oh my gosh okay we leveled out we leveled out we're in this huge storm right now okay we need to be pointing towards the waves we cannot be capsizing like that again that was absolutely terrible jeez i don't know how this thing flipped back over with this type of like sail or whatever that is on the top oh my gosh that's yeah, just not looking too good for us oh wait what why are there buttons here hold on um what does this mean guys hold on wait what's that oh 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 guys that's water entering our hall supposedly we have a huge water leak somewhere i think we cracked did we hit something i don't think we did what in the world that's so high oh my god wait do, do, does this thing have bilge pumps where are the bilge pumps at i need to know that right now i really need to know where this thing's bilge pumps are at because we are gonna sink here hold on what's it at now oh my gosh six thousand we have six thousand liters of water in the hall currently is it in here oh okay well we definitely have a water leak oh we're leaning towards the front really bad right now do you guys see that definitely have an issue going on here why are we in like reverse what the heck hold on what honestly i don't even know what's going on it's about to hit ten thousand liters of water in the hall um we're sinking what do we do um oh yeah eat my ramen noodles yes that will definitely help those are some good ramen noodles okay um yeah that's definitely what we need to do in this situation <laughs> Um, hold on, let's go outside the boat here, see what's going on out here. Um, we're definitely listing towards the front now. Um, what's going on? Oh, there's water on deck. Okay, yeah, this is definitely going into a serious issue here. Um, can we, is there like an anchor we can try? Oh, this thing's really listing towards the front. Hold on, we need to get back inside. I think that's a way safer option. Since it is waterproof in here, let's get back inside real quick. Oh no, we opened it at a really bad time. It's flooding. Oh my gosh. Oh no, 
we just let a whole bunch of water in. Hold on, how much? Yeah, that's not a concerning number at all. Um, Hold on, we're, we're having some major water warnings. Oh gosh, what's going on? Do we have any water in here? We're definitely sinking. I can feel it. Oh gosh, don't capsize again. It's really listing. Oh no, we're full on fuel too. So the fuel must be like really weighing us down. I was expecting to go like a couple kilometers over there, but I guess not. We're definitely sinking. It's about to hit 20,000 liters of water. Oh, that's not good good at all how is this thing still even floating what in the world the water is about to surround the bridge though um these windows are probably going to go underwater here but i don't know what to do honestly it's waterproof in here so i i think i could go down with it but i don't exactly know. not looking too good um our emergency floaty did go up so that's good at least that'll like locate where uh we sank at maybe oh this thing's going down uh oh hold on what's going on i don't see any water in here so it must all be in the hall hold on let's check out in the hall right now oh there's so much water in here okay yeah that's definitely the issue guys the water is going over the windows imagine these windows like started breaking these are like windows you install on your house not for like under oh oh gosh that was a really Oh no, these waves are getting deeper every time. We're, we're going deeper in the ocean. We're definitely sinking right now. Oh, oh, lightning. Okay, calm down. Well, um, this might be it. Um, the door's about to be underwater. I definitely can't open that because of all the water. I could I'm not strong enough to push water out of the way, but um, we're definitely sinking. I guess we do have like some we have three packets of ramen noodles down here still. So I guess that's a good part of what this is happening. Oh, we're going down really bad. Okay, we're like kind of bouncing out of the water slowly, but um hopefully this thing doesn't sink and it just like stays like this until coast guard can get here do we have like any emergency flares on board okay let's look for that we have a fire extinguisher do we have anything else that's like not useless currently the waves are going over the kitchen windows okay um i might hide in the bathroom here this is a terrible death hopefully our ac doesn't start kicking water in here because it is on we have thirty-one thousand liters of water currently in our hall right now not good stuff at all we're 100 sinking this is not good. This thing is going down fast. What in the world? Okay, we're going to be at the bottom of the ocean here in a second. That's not good. Um, how, how deep is this? Oh my gosh, it's so deep. I can't even see the bottom from here. How deep is this? We haven't even gone that far out. Hold on. I'm going to make myself another packet of ramen noodles, I think. That'll help me like not be stressed out about this. Here we go. Ramen noodles. It'll take like 10 minutes to cook, so we're just going to sit here and slowly enjoy our death while our ramen noodles are cooking, and also while we have power still ramen noodles are done let's go ahead and grab them okay this is my second pack today probably not that healthy um our ac is still running that's nice okay it's nice and cool in here mm, these are some good ramen noodles i always love eating ramen noodles while we're sinking not looking good not looking good um i have to use the bathroom okay, let's go up here in the bridge oh my gosh you can see underwater that's not something you normally see i normally want to see like the skyline in the bridge but no we're currently seeing what's underwater currently it's kind of cool though um i don't see any sharks so that's a good sign i can see our floaty here isn't that supposed to float to like the top to like help search and rescue people find us but no we're completely underwater now hold on we have to check our flood level oh we're completely underwater um our cabin area is like completely underwater that's not good our propeller is still spinning somehow i don't know how that thing's still spinning it's like broken oh this thing's going down fast um we are actually eventually gonna have to try getting out of here and escape and survive but i don't know how that's gonna work because we're all the way down here this door is gonna be really hard to open our propeller is sticking out of the water same with the rudder this is not good our navigation lights are still on i don't know where our battery's at but it must be in a really safe place because this water's not damaging it oh my gosh it's about to hit forty thousand. it's so close that's so oh oh gosh okay it's kind of bouncing around like 500 liters that's a ton of water bouncing around um okay maybe we should try escaping right now we probably should have done that earlier but here we go should we try opening this door um let's see should we should we open it should we open it and try and escape? I don't know. I don't want her to come and pour in here because that's definitely... Oh, it's still rising. It's still rising rapidly. Oh, gosh. It's just going to get deeper, I think. We definitely want to get out of here. Hold on. Open the door. All right. You guys ready? Three, two, one. Here we go. Oh, it's flooding. Okay, get out, get out, get out. Okay, we got out of the boat. It is flooding. It's going to go... It's going to sink way faster. Oh, my gosh. It's sinking way faster. Let me go on the boat. I don't want to drown. Okay, we're on the boat. We're on the boat. Oh, okay well i thought we had a place to like stand while it sank but i guess not oh my gosh it's going so deep oh well there that goes at least this thing floated back up what is this a crate how would that float up and not the emergency beacon things but anyway dude that thing's at the bottom of the ocean look at it but that's probably gonna be it for this video let me know if you'd like to see some more stormworks build and rescue content and more sinking ships let me know in the comments real quick what your favorite part of this video is and what kind of future content you'd like to see but make sure you guys like and subscribe hit that bell thanks for watching and goodbye